Uh, I'm Kobe Vortman, uh, the president and CEO of Insitec uh, from Israel. Uh, Insitec started 12 years ago uh, to take MR guided fast technology uh, from the lab into the patient bedside. And uh, for the last 12 years, we are the pioneers and the leaders in this field. Prostate cancer, which is a relatively common disease, is suffering today uh, not from lack of, of technology that could treat it, but mainly from the fact that significant adverse events are uh, coming with those uh, treatment uh, alternatives. Most of them are uh, in the area of uh, impotence and incontinence, and they are severe. Uh, diagnostic techniques are detecting uh, prostate cancer at a younger population. And for this population, those uh, adverse events are even more significant. When we looked on this significant gap between treatment effectiveness and uh, treatment safety, uh, we identified a couple of significant technology uh, gaps that we will need to fill before we move into this field. And we believe we can change this equation mm -hmm. of tight correlation between effectiveness and adverse events. The last two years, or yes, three years, we have uh, succeeded to develop a new type, a new breed of therapy, a very high density phased array. Uh, we are speaking about 1,000 elements that will allow a very accurate submillimeter treatments, be able to treat near uh, the areas that are perceived to be responsible for the adverse events, the narrow vascular bundles, and the apex and the base and the sphincters. Uh, those are uh, very critical areas. About 85% of the tumors will, will be uh, found in the peripheral zone that is very, very close to the neurovascular bundles and some of them to the sphincters. As of now, we are focusing on the low risk, but ev eventually it is clear that we'll need to address both mid-risk and high-risk patients, uh, and we intend to do it. From uh, implementation point of view, we are uh, uh, at phase one clinical trials, we are treating humans. Um, we are hoping uh, at the middle of next year to finish phase one and then uh, develop phase two and three. 